Yo. Yo. It's uh, 28-8 again. Ah, uh, so... I spoke to the idiot. Yeah. And, you know, he told me, like, uh, you know, the things might slow down. Yeah, I don't know. It's just... I spoke to Future yesterday about it a bit. We were going to look at some properties to see, but... It kind of made it seem like everyone's still a bit on the fence about it. So I'm just a bit over, like, the fucking back and forth trying to convince and pull off miracles just to get shit expanded when when we need it you know so i think just to fix all the problems just find growers and then if you don't need as much weed you just buy less and if you need more you buy more you know people don't want to reinvest in this shit so and i get the other oh you don't grow enough weed like well i don't have, i only have one fucking house so oh, give me one second. you know what i'm saying so fuck it so okay hold on I mean, right now we need more weed. Yeah, I know that, but I can only, I can only grow so much, you know. Yeah. So like uh, the, way, the way I mean, the, the way it did explain it to me is like you're not gonna be able to grow as much. Well, the hours where I need to like wake up to start doing the stuff is like super early, and it's it's a bit. I don't know. It, it's a lot of stuff that how do I explain it? Scheduling wise, it's really hard. For me to actually do it, it's like, I don't know, it's just, it's just difficult and it's just not worth it. And now if I could wake up later or have two storms to be able to tap into, it'd be a lot easier too, but it's just, uh, just annoying. I need to wake up at like fucking 6 a.m. and then I end up finishing 12 hours later, you know, and I mean, most uh, people just, I mean, okay. they'll take a nap, come back when the weeds are ready, you know? Let me, let me, put, it, let me put it this around. way, let me put it this way, right? I don't, I don't, I don't expect you to like fucking go out of your way and, you know, fucking, you know, break your back over this shit, right? Like you guys want to grow, and you're growing, like just grow whenever you feel like growing. I'm not like no one, no one's expecting you to fucking like, you know, fucking yeah, grow. Yeah, but the grow your way to grow. Need, uh, I mean, uh, yeah, and then we have to, we just have to like fix it another way. You know what I mean? Like if I had two houses and I can do fucking eighteen plots every grow. So what two houses fix it? I mean, yeah, I've been saying that for fucking months now, but people don't want to do that, so it's better to find a grower, you know? And then if well, no, 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 we didn't, we didn't want to do that because for like two or three weeks, there was nobody on the block. It was pointless You preferred that. the butt coin stuff over the, over the fucking weed stuff, no? Yeah, because there was, the, the, listen, at one point in time, uh, after we, you know, I some of the sellers, uh, the block was down horrendous. Like, there was no point of expanding the block when, yeah, no, I when, know. when we were going through, the, we weren't even going through the weed. I, I, at one point, I had to stop with you. To grow weed, I was like, yo, you know, stop growing weed because we're going to sell what you're growing. Yeah, yeah, right I know. So what was the point of even buying a house at that point? You know what I mean? Well, because the, the tariff's always going to be ups and downs. But uh, the now, it's now control, yeah, you know? I mean, not, but the thing is, now I'm more willing to buy a house just because if, uh, you know, the weed ever goes to shit and we don't need it, we can always uh, turn yeah. the house into um, growing stuff for moonshine. I want to get into the moonshine business as well. Because I don't know if okay. you know, I don't know if you know, but... um. So this yeah, I was thought to have like the big tanks now or something, right? Yeah, so some guy named Reverend has like a distillery. Like it's like it's like a big distillery, a bigger distillery than the one we had. Okay. And uh like Kevin's like growing vegetables indoors. Like for ingredients for moonshine, right? Mm. -hmm. And the guy the guy uh the moonshine guy up north is uh he's got a new job, you know, he's like offering new jobs out, you know what I'm saying? That's why I'm kinda interested in uh Getting into the moonshine business. All right. Yeah. Fuck it. Why not? So you know? that's why I'm more, I'm more willing to buy a house now because if weed shit goes to shit, we can just always pretend into a moonshine house. You know? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Fuck it. Is it good money though? If we like really like. I I, I really like don't or? know. I really don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Why not? I mean, if Kevin enjoys doing that shit. Let's see what, what we can get out of it. But, but that's what I'm saying. Like, I would buy another house for weed, right? Uh, But uh, what I'm saying is, like, let's say, you know, we buy another house for weed. And in two months' time or a month time, we, we nowhere, nowhere near need as much weed for the block. We can just, you know, turn the house into your moonshine house. You know what I mean? Like, it just... It's, it's not a bad thing to do, to have it. Yeah. Yeah, to be honest, I kind of expected Maynard to... Turn his virus into like a gross spot too when he uh, got that spot from Long. 
but I guess yeah, they're turning into washing machines yeah. now too, you know. Yeah. But it's alright, I mean. Yeah, if the thing right, is, right though, now, what like, do we buy? One of the growing shit, though, bro. Like, it's just, it's so fucking boring. Like, I do it to help, but I, it's a fucking chore, man. It's just, <laughs> you know. Okay, well, I mean, if you guys don't want to do it, that's fine, too. Well, it's mostly been just me now. Just you? Okay, so I can get step back. It's the only way they wake him up to help if I need it, but. But yeah, so I don't know if she'll come around a lot. We're going for it, but we'll see. Okay, well, let me ask you then. Like, how, how do you want to, like, what do you want me to do? do well, I think we just find growers and then I'll, I'll grow growers? whenever I can. And then we'll see how it goes. And, you know, like I said, if we make money with the stuff that we're doing and we, like, even like yesterday, there's other priorities we have to look at too, right? Like preparing the gang for potential conflict to come with this or that, like we need to be prepared. If we at some point want to expand and, you know, sure, but I think it's easier just to find growers, we'll buy from them, and if our demand decreases or increases, we'll buy more or buy less. Do you want other growers? I think it'll be easier, yeah. Do you want to keep growing that one house, and then do you want me to find other growers to help out? Yeah, and if we ever, like, get into a position where like we ramp up the ground again or someone taps in we can always buy more houses and go from there but i think for now if we get a quick solution is to find a grower all right yeah i can do that actually i had somebody uh that came up to me to grow that's good uh you know winston yeah yeah i know winston i don't have his number do you have his number by any chance yeah, yeah i was talking to him about the uh Solar panel bullshit. Yeah, so he came up to me and offered to grow, and he said it would charge us $300 uh, per brick, which is not bad. I guess so, yeah. Okay, this is Winston's number. I mean, listen, Julian, like I said, I don't want, listen, if you, if you want me to buy another house, or if you, like, it's up to you, right? If you don't want to grow as much, then. I I'm happy to find another grower. But if you want to grow in two houses, then we can also do that. Yeah. Um. I mean, I think finding a grower, even if we get a house, is, is a good solution anyway. Because we'll have to do the signs and all that ramp up time. So having a grower is good regardless. Just make it a thing where, you know, you buy if you need it. If you need less, you buy less, right? It's, it's no hurt in that. And if we need more ourselves later on on the in-house side of things, we can always do that. Because I think I still got to talk to um, what's it called, the future about the other group that's like they're gonna sell now. Because I think they wanted to grow too. Who? Uh, with Fidel and um, well, Kevin I guess is now doing the farming stuff, but Kevin wanted to grow, yeah. But I I'd rather have Kevin do the moonshine shit. Yeah. I can talk to um. To Maynard, too. I wonder if Riz has any sort of interest in that shit, too. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. We, we, we can explore options, but I think having a grower on, on like, a hot dial is good anyway, though. You know what I'm saying? There's no hurt in having a grower, like, plug we can call. Okay, so I'll just get a... I'll get another grower for us. Yeah, hit up Winston, see what he says. Um... Um, we'll, just, we'll figure it out, you know, weigh our options and see what we got. Do you, do you, do you know anything about Winston? Like, do you know if, like, what do you know he about He used to him? be a cop. I know he that. He used to be a detective. A... Um, so, I don't know the crowd he hangs around with, but I can easily find it out, though. But I think all he's been doing nowadays is just kind of solar panel shit. Um, he's a good dude, though, like. I don't think you'll be like uh, another like, you know. Yeah. A big risk or whatever. Kind of, kind of unrelated, right? But uh, I want to have a meeting with the whole gang. Hopefully, mm -hmm. people can be run today. Uh, like I want to, I want to start bringing in more people. You know. Yeah, I mean, there's a few good options already there. I mean, there's two options that are, I think, are pretty solid. They must be bringing like, soon. Maytard and Poe. 
Probably, yeah. right? Yeah. I think if if you give the guy a bit of reason to get more involved, I think Vidal could be a good pick too. I mean, I brought him in before too for a reason, you know, Vidal was solid. You could do him out, see how you like, you like him or not. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of people. But I think two people that are like, you know, been close to us and did a lot of shit with us is Cal, yeah. uh, Paul and the uh, idiot. I was also thinking about Cal Pred, but uh, who knows, you know? hundred oh, percent, bro. <laughs> you gotta stop pushing him away though, because you know what he's like. He's gonna find shit to do, you know. I, I think about, I think, I'm thinking about, <laughs> I'm thinking about getting Cal Pred in the gang. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you should, bro. You should be. You know, he said he's bored of being a lawyer. He wants to shoot cops. There you go. Yeah, I like Kyle.